Good morning, everyone. I'm Riley King, and welcome to this morning news report right here on the Riley King Network. Let's begin. Coatts County, only area of New Hampshire with substantial spread of COVID-19. Health officials say high rate partly due to county's low population. COVID-19 community transmission is now considered moderate or minimal in every New Hampshire county but Coas, which remains in the substantial range but is making progress, health officials say. Officials with the Department of Health and Human Services said cases in Kowas County are dropping and they expect to trend to continue there and across the state. Dr. Benjamin Chan, the state epidemiologist, said the risk of being exposed to someone with COVID-19 has dropped significantly compared to a few months ago. From about mid-November through mid-May, our entire state was at a high or substantial level of community transmission of COVID-19, he said. Merrimack, Rockingham, and Hillsborough counties are now seeing minimal transmission except for the cities of Nashua and Manchester, which are considered moderate, along with much of the rest of the state. Coas County is the only one with substantial transmission. Officials said it appears there could be two factors for this, one being population. There have been 39 cases in Kawas County in the past 14 days, which equals and equates to a higher rate because of its smaller population size. Kawas County was also the last part of the state to experience a spike in cases, so its decrease will likely be delayed compared to the rest of the state, officials said. The southern part of the state saw the increase in community transmission early, Chan said. That moved around the state and eventually hit the North Country, and what we're seeing now is community transmission is decreasing first in the southern part of the state. Chan said he expects more counties will begin to fall into the minimal transmission category. And that does it for this morning news report right here on the Riley King Network. I hope you all have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you back here later on today for another news report. Goodbye, everyone.